The Story of Yeshua, Jesus' Birth In the days of Herod, king of Yehuda, Judah, there was a priest named Zechariah, who belonged to the Yeriah Abijah division. His wife was a descendant of Aharon, and her name was Elisheva Elizabeth. Both of them were righteous before God, observing all the commands and ordinances of Adonai, the Lord, blamelessly. But they had no children, because Elisheva was barren, and they were both well along in years. One time, when Zechariah was fulfilling his duties as priest, during his division's period of service before God, he was chosen by lot, according to the custom among the priesthood to enter the temple and burn incense. All the people were outside praying at the time of the incense burning, when there appeared to him an angel of Adonai the Lord, standing to the right of the incense altar. Zechariah was startled and terrified at the sight, but the angel said to him, Do not be afraid, Zechariah, because your prayer has been heard. Your wife, Elisheva, will bear you a son, and you are to name him your channon, John. He will be a joy and a delight to you, and many people rejoice when he is born, for he will be great in the sight of Adonai the Lord. He is never to drink wine or other liquor, and he will be filled with the Rosh Hakodesh. The Holy Spirit, even from his mother's womb, he will turn many of the people of Israel to Adonai the Lord their God. He will go ahead of Adonai the Lord in the spirit and power of Eliyahu Elijah to turn the hearts of fathers to their children. Malachi 3.23-24 Some other versions it's found in 4, 5-6 to six. And the disobedient to the wisdom of the righteous to make ready for Adonai the Lord, a people prepared. Zechariah said to the angel, How can I be sure of this? For I am older men. My wife too is well on yours. I am Gabriel, the, answer, the angel answered him, and I stand in the presence of God. I was sent to speak to you to give you this good news. Now, because you didn't believe what I said, which will be fulfilled when the time comes, you will be silent, unable to speak until the day these things take place. Meanwhile, the people were waiting for Zechariah. They were surprised at his taking so long in the temple. But when he came out, unable to talk to them, they realized, they realized that he had seen a vision in the temple. Speechless, he communicated to them with signs. When the period of his temple service was over, he returned home. Following this, Elisheva, his wife, conceived, and she remained five months in seclusion, saying, Adonai, the Lord, has done this for me. He has shown me favour at this time so as to remove my public disgrace.